Buongiorno guys, it's Max Finestra, in Jakarta, Indonesia. I'm super excited because today I'm going to be trying a lot of delicious street food from satay to unique desserts and super mega spicy duck. Andiamo! Satu kado kado fa. Pedas ya? Pakai lontong ta? Iya. <laughs> okay, we start making gado gado. Chili. Oh my god. You're gonna make it spicy. Itu gula. Yeah, gula. Gula Jawa. Kacang. Kacang kan. All the veggies, tempe, yeah. This is a vegetarian dish, very popular in Indonesia. This is a good option if you don't want to eat meat and eat something light. That's rice cake. More veggie, bean sprouts, cabbage, mix is it. It's gonna be awesome. Sweet, peanutty, breakfast. Oh, here we are. We have Krupuk as well. <laughs> Good day. Makasi pa. All right. Oh my God, it's huge. <laughs> I'm ready for breakfast. Gado, gado. This beautiful mixture of veggies, lonton, which is rice cake, chili, and peanut sauce. Buon appetito! Mamma mia! Oh, spicy! Mm. Oh, wow! Oh, yes, this is spicy. And aqua? And a bang, is it? Uh, yeah. <laughs> what I love about it is the peanut sauce, sweet, the mix of texture between the lonton, and then you have the bean sprouts that are a bit crunchy. Now I want to add krupuk, my favorite. Crush a little bit. Mm. The best breakfast, definitely. Terima kasih ya Pak. Mari, it was so delicious, super spicy. Actually, because I requested the sauce, you can actually request it without chili, but it was worth it because I love chili. So, andiamo to the next destination. Sama pagi, to satu porsi mi pansi baso. Kasi, so we came to a legendary place to have uh, mi ayam, which is a popular dish. This is going to be our second breakfast. We have noodles, Chinese cabbage, boiled together with baso, meatballs, and pansi, wonton. Two ketchup, yeah. your soy sauce, and mix everything. Bean sprouts. Boom. Here we are the platinars. Noodles, bean sprouts, cabbage, chicken. Oh, yes, that looks nice. I can see. That's it. Our massive bowl of chicken noodles is ready. Take a look. Noodles with chicken, cabbage, fried shallots, green onions. Oh, Mamma mia. Here, we also order some pansi, which are wonton and basso, meatballs. Let's get a piece of chicken and noodles. Buon appetito. Oh no no no! This is definitely a legendary bike. It's a bit sweet. I love the fresh shallots because they add a lot to it. Then you can taste a bit of the spring onion, the soy sauce, the garlic. You know what? Let's add a bit of the broth. Now, perfect touch. Spicy sauce. 
I love spicy food, especially here in Indonesia, because they have thousands of varieties of sambal. This is a dish that in Indonesia everyone loves, and you can have it for breakfast, for lunch, dinner. It's not fixed rule, and it's just one of the iconic dishes of Indonesia. For who? For lunch, we came to have a satay. In this satay, I am. So, chicken satay. They serve chicken satay, satay kambing, so goat satay, and also tongseng. Been waiting for this moment for so long. You can smell the smokiness, the sweetness of the sauce. We are right on the street. It's lunchtime. This place is getting full. Locals love satay, and I do as well. I mean, who doesn't love meat skewers? Come on. Oh, wait, this is the Tongsen station. The soup station. Oh. They're cooking the meat, I guess that's kambin. That's goat. You too, kambin? Or? Yeah, I am. Kambin. That's goat. Well, oh, look at the fire. <laughs> Need a water. You can get really hot in this station. <laughs> you really hot. Oh, this is the stock. Oh. Ketchup manis. Then tomatoes. Everything is fresh. It's getting there, almost ready. Pepper, salt. I guess MSG as well. Honestly, it looks really good. And it also smells delicious. Oh, cabbage. Santanada. Yes, Santa. Oh, they also added coconut milk inside. That's why the color of the broth is this light. See, the tongsen is almost ready. They add some more veggies, spring onions, cabbage, and some more tomatoes. In a couple of minutes, we will have it in our stomach. And I just realized that they use charcoal, they didn't use gas. Oh, pala is ready. Tongs and kambi. Goat meat, cabbage, tomatoes, chili, pepper, galanga. It smells incredible. Our lunch has arrived. We have satay ayam, chicken skewers with peanut sauce. Then we have lontan, rice cake, my favorite, and then this incredible kambing tongsai. This is a very rich and complex soup. Buon appetito. Mm -hmm. Oh wow! Mamma mia! It's so good! Sweet, coconutty, peppery. Bit tomatoey, the meat is tender and fatty. Oh, look, look. Look at these uh, chunks of kambi, chunks of goat, tomatoes. What I love also is cabbage. It gives this uh, fresh and crunchy touch to it. This is traditionally from Solo, which is uh, from central Java. Yeah, now it's time for the satay. Let's completely soak them up in the sauce. Mamma mia. I love sauce kacang. Buon appetito. Mm. So good. Got a bit of the lonton. Dip it in. Super mega tender. Actually, the peanut sauce is not too sweet. It's nice peanut -y. Still, you can find crunchy peanuts in it. So very tender, lean, smoky, nicely charred. Whatever do you want? This is one of the delicacies of Indonesia. Sato Chandol Durian.
Casi. Casi, pa. As a dessert, we can do a very local jam. Take a look at what they serve. Chandol durian. This place got really famous among locals because he uses uh, several varieties of uh, durian and is pretty generous with it, which is unusual. Then, of course, everything starts with shaved ice, coconut milk. These are chendol made with uh, rice flour and pandan. And then they add uh, gula jawa. Um, oh, mama. Pa, in a bang. Manta. Coconut milk, sweet, and the nice touch of durian. One of the smelliest foods in the world. And, and now I want to try the durian itself. Wow. So buttery. So creamy. It tastes like really nothing else you ever tried before. This is something that I tried for the very first time. I think I was in Australia, but I tried the frozen one. And then I said, I don't think I like it. I will never try it again. But I came to Indonesia, I tried, a, I tried the fresh one, and I absolutely fell in love with it. Durian is one of the world's best delicacies. Oh my God, this is huge. Mm. Oh. It's different to the one that I tried before. Oh, wow. Mantap. <laughs> Mantap. Sudah berapa lama di sini, Pak? Sudah 22 tahun. He's been serving uh, Chando Duria for... 22 years. Oh, wow. Yeah, it became definitely an institution among locals. Mantap. They had panja umu. Amin. Amin. Dan selalu sukses. Amin. Makasih ya. Ah, getting full, but we have one more place to go. So, andiamo. We got invited inside the kitchen. Hello, bro. Hello. Oh, bakwan goreng. And a bang. Look at the duck. Mamma mia, look at the duck. Look at all the spices that go into it. Oh, wow, this is a secret mixer for sure. Hello. And a bang at her. The best. <laughs> look, they, they washing the duck there. This restaurant is an absolute machine. Any uh, sambal? Yeah, any sambal. Oh, this is the sambal. Bumbunya apa? Bumbunya. Banya. <laughs> it's, a, it's a secret. <laughs> you see, there are a, a lot of um, a lot of spices in it. See, it's dark. This is the secret of the famous duck. What an incredible opportunity to get a deep inside of a local kitchen. Famous um, yeah, baby Oh, it looks so good. Whoa. That's the secret sauce. Because for lunch we came to have this incredibly looking baby, which is fried duck covered in this secret sauce, black sauce. We also ordered a couple of pawan goreng, which is a mixed fried veggies. Got a nice piece. Buon appetito. Mm. Oh my god. Mmm. Bye, In a bun. Do I? Bun top. In a bun, yeah? But just bun. Yeah. <laughs> he loved it. He had the two plates of it. The secret is definitely on this um, sambal. It's smoky, it's aromatic, it's fragrant. In a bun, bro. In a bang, on top. <laughs> I'm too. For this bang, for this bang. <laughs> I'm, I'm tearing, even him is tearing a bit. Now let me try Bawangore. 
Oh, no. This is just so comforting. I think it is carrots, cabbage, and something else. I love baby. It's not as meaty as the chicken, of course. It's less tender, but it's more flavorful. What an incredible experience. Oh my God, the food is amazing. The people were so nice. I also managed to buy their signature sambal. So that's it with our first Indonesia video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks a lot for watching and see you next Sunday. Ciao.